Okay, start. There you go, reverse. And we can reverse easily because we have 360 camera here. But I like doing it this way. This is the Ferrari Roma Spider. It's so great to experience a convertible on a nice sunny road like this. Very nice weather. The purpose actually for having a California, the Portofino, and this Roma Spider is to have a somewhat practical Ferrari that you can live with. I think what Ferrari wanted is uh, to have a manageable, a livable, a breathable, something that you can actually give less energy to focus on driving and just really relax and experience all this nature and such. And even if you put it to race, it will not be a crazy, mind-blowing, difficult to control car. Although this is a rear-wheel drive car, it's not that crazy. It's not that crazy. So you can really manage it. And that's the horn sound. Right now we're driving in automatic mode, but we can also put it down. And now it's first, auto, manual. So you can do that very fast if you want to. But if you don't want to, you don't have to do that. You really enjoy just in the first gear like this and instant torque, instant torque. And the sound is just amazing. That's the speed you can feel. I'm just gonna do a quick burst. So first gear. What a fun car to drive. Crazy. It feels, it's another feeling of driving a Japanese car. So when you drive European cars, especially like this one, which is an Italian car, you will immediately feel the difference of why people would invest in buying an Italian car or a European car. Now I can say that I have experienced driving a Ferrari. How can the shifting be this quick? It's like almost magical. It's so, so quick. Thank you again, Velocita Motors. This is a great, great experience. First and second gear is all you need for driving this and experiencing what does it feel to drive a Ferrari. What do you mean? what happens to your hair when you drive a Ferrari. First of all, this is the Ferrari Roma Spider. It's the spider of the Ferrari Roma Coupe. I want to thank my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ for giving me the opportunity to finally drive a Ferrari. And also, thank you so much, Velocita Motors, for letting me experience your wonderful car and those who are watching you can experience ferrari in their new showroom in edsa what you have right here is the convertible version of the ferrari roma which had a hard top it is an italian luxury italian engineering italian performance that makes this somewhat entry ferrari such an everyday car it's a grand tourer after all and this one right here, it starts from 29.5 million. And this specific unit had some upgrades, especially on its aesthetics, which can go about 34 million pesos. 
What we have here is a 3.9 liter V8 engine. It is a multi-awarded Ferrari engine, 620 cavallo vapor, which is somewhat similar with horsepower, but not the same. And it can do about 760 Newton meters of torque, which translates to zero to 100 in just 3.4 seconds. For the transmission, we have an eight speed F1 dual clutch transmission. I just drove it with my good friend Don, and the rest is history, the specs and all these things will come later because the experience is that much exhilarating and such a fun experience that I'll never forget in my life. I'm very happy to share this moment with my good friend Don here. Please do subscribe to his channel. Not a pro driver, but he's pro. The Ferrari Roma Spider has weight distribution of 48% anterior and 52% posterior. And weight distribution is very much important in a performance car like this. And the weight 1,556 kg, which is also really important for a car like this. For the front wheel, we have P0 here, 245-35Z R20. P0's 285-35Z R20. So it's wider, which is fit for a rear wheel drive like this. The last time Ferrari has released a soft top front engine was 56 years ago and now we have it in the form of Ferrari Roma Spider. Let me show you how it turns into a convertible. Just press this button or pull it. Pull. Now it's a convertible and now it's a convertible <laughs> let's talk about the interior i was able to experience the pinnacle of luxury and, and performance in a very quick manner just looking at the cockpit here at first i was really confused like what am i going to do everything's different because a ferrari usually has driver focused interior but when you move here we have dual cockpit experience. Even your passenger can see how crazy you're driving. You see that? So if I press the accelerator, yeah, that's what your passenger or your wife can also experience with you, which might not be a good thing, huh? You are greeted with full screen, hardwares, and lots of leather. And you get the feel of being in a game it's like i'm in a logitech but that's such an understatement just like other ferraris it also has this manettino which means the tiny button which is still a physical button by the way so we have wet comfort sport race and the button that we should not go which is uh, esc off you can just like do that and then it goes there it turns off the traction never do that never do that unless it's your own car I can control the seat of the passenger from in the screen, the gear selector. It looks like it's going to go up and down. I thought it's going to behave like a fader, but it's uh, like I, I'm on the brake. It's th those are wow, look at that. Oh wow, do you see that? This one, voila. This one, oh meron. You can see those. Nice. I wonder how this car would look like at night, but right now it's so amazing. And now I want you to see the. 360 camera it's so clear and you need to get used to it because normally it would appear here but it is appearing on the instrument cluster so i guess that's the future we're heading to and it's very much helpful especially driving a car like this especially looking at the front it might have a very high um, object that might really scrape your beautiful roma can you press the brake oh yon wow look at those brake lights okay how about the reverse I suppose this is the, okay, that's so cute. Okay, put it to neutral using the paddle shifters. Yup. And then we're gonna listen to a bit of the acceleration or the revs. <laughs> that's thick and I really like that. <laughs> And that was my first ever experience with a Ferrari in my life. 
and I hope you guys also enjoyed the experience. Trust me, you need to experience it to believe it that it's not all about the specs. It's not all about numbers. It's all about the overall holistic experience that you get to experience with the Ferrari Roma Spider. It really blew my mind. So thank you again, Velocita Motors, for trusting me with the car. And with that, I'll see you in the next video. May your dreams come true, everyone.